Good morning guys, so we are back for show day two. It's been a long weekend so far, so we are going up to Manchester this morning and we're doing PCA Manchester in the bodybuilding tall class. So it's going to be a big class because all the guys who've done super heavyweights yesterday, I was talking to them and they're going up to do the tall class today in PCA too. So it's gonna be them guys plus whoever else is doing it too. So it should be a big class and they're nice guys as well. So we, you know, we should have a laugh and yeah, I'm looking forward to the day. So just get some water down, got my subs down. I'm gonna eat in a few minutes. I'll send pictures to Cuba and then that will leave us at about half six and then we can kind of map out the next few hours and what we're gonna do. But once I send pictures to Cuba, I will kind of gather all my shit and get it in the car. And then we will leave here about quarter to nine. The register for PCA is at half nine. We're only like half an hour away. So get there, half nine. And then I have like three hours till I'm on stage. I'll probably be on stage at like 12, half 12, I reckon. And I'm going to use dream time today, as I said. So I'm gonna need time to actually get Jim to do that for me because that could, I haven't used it before. So we need to take our time and really apply that. So once I register, I'll go, I'll probably put that on, take our time doing that, and then we've plenty of time to kind of let that set and kind of get ready. But that is the game plan. We'll be doing along. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it. I think we'll be, we'll be finishing all by like maybe one o'clock today, half one latest. So uh, yeah, today won't, won't be as long as Jen or Chloe aren't competing. So they can just run around and look after us today. But yeah, it's gonna be a quick morning. But yeah, I love this. I love these weekends. It's been four years since these sort of weekends with shows and stuff. So yeah, I think it's important that I'm embracing it. Even last night, like an hour before bed, I just touched, but I turned my, swap, turned my, turned my phone off. Um, no notifications coming through or anything. I just sat there and ate my meal and just decompressed. Um, I think it's important to enjoy the moments because there are moments that you will look back on. You know, everything passes by, but all you're left with is memories. I know that's deep for a, a Sunday morning, but like all you're left with is memories. So embrace them, sit in things that are happening and just like, just enjoy the moments because that's what you remember. Crisp. Very, very crisp. Look better than this morning, don't they? Yeah. You look better than this morning for sure. Just have to be careful. I need to, I need to make sure it stays like that. Yeah. Yeah, I think this look now, you just need to fucking hold it, mate. Hold this and just like, just make sure we don't get like any fatter because you still got that pop to your room. <sighs> mate, I think you're a touch tighter again, yeah. but, but not flatter at all yet. But you do have a while to hold it, so you just stick with the meals you have. Just make, make sure that those meals hold it. We'll keep. We'll keep looking at you, mate. I would, like, I would just go with what Cooper says, like, obviously just... That's better than this morning. Yeah, yeah so it is. Glutes are definitely tighter. Your glutes are tighter, man. The legs are a lot sharper. The skin, even from yesterday, the skin of the side of the glutes here yeah. is just thinner. Yeah. He'd be happy with those. And I'd say he'd probably say, like, the, the food, like, he'd probably stick with the higher food because he, he won't, he will, he won't. He's going to take he's, the high food. He's going to see your tighter there. Work, he, isn't it? Yeah, he's going to see your tighter there and stick with the higher food, and I think we may, maybe you should, man. No, seriously, you stick with the higher food. Yeah, because I feel, it poses Cause I, feel, I, I feel, I feel full. like you're fucking, like, you're, you're, you're sharper again, so I do think you need to stick with that higher food, or you, you might flatten off too much. And when I pump up as well, I know, like, yeah. it'll be. Yeah. Things like, you don't want to get any, like, flatter, you still want to have that pop to you at the moment, because you know that if you do get flatter, then it's, you're probably just going to Because think about it, Mark, right? You're probably going to be on stage in four hours mate yeah and like with the adrenaline if I get on now I'll be well. buzzing man yeah. fuck's sake my glutes and hands are much better huh glutes and hands are much your better your glutes are way tighter it's here right do you know when you're hitting that shot there all yeah. along here way sharper fuck's sake even when you're getting into shots and stuff even that back shot like the back has had a detail yeah so yeah okay I was actually I was kind of looking at your legs a lot instead of I know your back is always I really know, yeah, so yeah. I was looking at like <laughs> he looks at the, the glutes okay guys so send pictures over to Cuba there and He's pretty happy. I think I'm definitely a little bit tighter than yesterday. A little bit drier, a little bit lighter as well, like half a kilo. So what we're going to do is the first meal is going to be 75 grams of rice, have 100, um, 50 grams of banana with this as well, 30 grams of almond butter, three squares bars, 40 grams of honey. And am I forgetting anything? No, that's pretty much it. And then 500 mils of water. Well, I'll have 350 mils of water, then I'll have 150 in the coffee. But that is the first meal going down. So I'll have this now, half six. And I'll repeat that again, about half a quarter to nine just before we leave. And then pre-stage, 
I will have 40 crispy square squares, 20 grams of almond butter and 40 grams of honey. But that's gonna be like an hour and a half to two hours before stage, not even the last actual meal, which will give it the time for the stomach to really set and just gonna be super, super tight before getting on stage. So that is game plan for food was I'll have this, I'll chill out, and then I'll get the rest of the food ready for the next couple of meals before we pack everything up. But I'm happy, I'm happy. So let's have this, let's chill out, watch some YouTube and enjoy the day. Let's go. Fuck. Screen record that, man. Yeah. What's about that? Me and Biasha, boy. Nine yeah. pro wins. You saying that, don't you? We're on the up and up, baby. Right. He's happy, so we'll just crack on and we'll take a look again. He's happy. You're happy. Everyone's happy. It's all good. Probably my Apple Watch into charge this morning. I made my move, and it was all about you. No, I feel so far removed. Good. <laughs> <laughs> nice to see you too. <laughs> Manchester boxed off. So, first caught out in a very, very good class of mine. Big, big boys. It's crazy when I, I walked backstage with these guys years ago. 
you know, I was looking at guys like this and I was like, fucking hell, like they're big. And now I'm in car and in categories, which I'm going to compete against them and beat some of them as well, which is crazy. So, fifth out of nine, four came ahead of me were, were, were big guys as well. But um, today, this morning, I felt really good. I felt a lot joy yesterday as well. And as the day went on, I just held a lot more water. I was losing detail. I just, the look just, just kind of faded away. Um, but either way, I, I still would have placed where I was. It's not, it didn't affect my pacing, but it's just, obviously, you want to bring your best to stage. You're just looking, I was, I was good, but maybe yesterday I was a little bit better. And this morning, I was definitely a little bit better as well. So, definitely some data to look through there. Two back to back peaks two days in a row is difficult. Not many people do it. And that's why, because though, it doesn't always go, you know, you don't always bring your best look on both days. You can't, you can't expect that. So, uh, yeah, we'll take a look at the data and we'll move forward to potentially show in a few weeks, which I won't say just yet, but I'll probably do another show. Um, again, just to see where I stand, if I can look better again, and go from there. But yeah, that is today boxed off. We're going to drive home now. I'm going to drive. It's two o'clock, so we drive home. I'm going to have a chicken meal, uh, just chicken on its own, and then I'll probably go get sushi later on this evening, uh, and then back to from tomorrow morning. Um, probably I'll take a look at pictures and then we'll decide on, sh on show from there. But that is the game plan. Jen is off to Italy on Thursday to Milan for next week's qualifier. So I'm not going to go with her, but I'm going to go to the do the shows that she has come for next few weeks as well. But yeah, time to sit back and just evaluate this weekend and what went good, what went bad, what could be better. But when, like, just just like, take it all in really. So I'm going to decompress. My mind is wrecked. I can't wait to sleep later on as well. But um, I'll do for the wrap ups obviously as we go, but I'm not going to ramble on all day. This one, I'll leave it there. Hope you enjoy the two show day videos. But there's going to be more coming, maybe not from me, but from clients and from Gem as well. So stay tuned. I thank you very much as usual for following along.